Okay. Well, I have a bunch of money, so time to fucking fuse a bunch of shit. Welcome to the world. Are you registered? Register. Uh, register. Uh, register. Uh, register. Uh, register. Then I don't really care about anybody else. Alright, I'm... Queen Med. Are you dying in Maza? Not a... I'll see. Do I want Queen Med? Cheapest I can use before. 15,000? 15,000. Oh. So she is fire and wind. Not gonna give her electoral one because that won't be much more anything. Is this demon to your liking? That is some words right there. Hey, I can use Lilith now. Well, eventually. Leo Marion. Megadola. Hmm. She's gonna have. Oh, I wish. Ah, uh, I'm not level 68. Side beat. Side beat, good. That hair, though. That's good hair. Uh, I don't know who I want to fuse. Oh, hey, I, can, I actually can fuse Loki now. Sweet. Agidine, Mazandine. Great Mana Spring. Great Mana Spring might be pretty baller. Alright, let me think. So, Bufudine, Ziodine, Agidine, Mazandine. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna have him be super AoE focused. Great mana spring. And if I'm not gonna be using him to spam AoE, then I don't need safeguard. You know what? I think this is pretty alright. So he'll have ice, lightning, fire, and wind, and then a bunch of MP to just lay the hands on him. Is this demon to your liking? Uh, now the question is, who am I using to fuse into him again? Queen Med and Lamu. Uh, he won't get a bunch of it. He won't get nearly as much stats or experience as I would like, but... You know what? It's fine. Is this demon to your liking? That's yeah, good enough. <laughs> uh, do I ditch my Bufu Dine or do I ditch regular Bufu Dine? Yeah, Loki's older model is pretty sweet. Alright. <clears throat> so 
So let me think. Uh, I think I'll have the MC do some AOE stuff, and Loki will just be like, ah. uh, let me think. Mm, but I, uh, Titania, Queen of the Fairies. Titania is pretty good, pretty good. Fairy banquet. Oh, I need I need Ganesha for Fizz Pluroma and Critical Zealot. Uh, is that a Grasu good? No, not really. Hecatone Shires. Critical Aura. Oh, I can. Ooh, I can get Critical Zealot from him? Okay, so I'm gonna make Hecatone Shires and hopefully get that good stuff. Uh, Alright, thank God I have all this money. So 42,000 there. Uh, you know, I'm probably not gonna use Lamu anymore. Oh, hey, free. Cloth of Moloch. I mean, I'm, I'm really only going to have him on hand for getting his essence, which is actually going to be a pain in the ass to do now that I think about it. Unless I can use him to fuse Yoshitsune. Like, fuse down and then do up. Pressure onslaught. Well, I... Is this? What is mortal jihad? Heavy to one foe. Oh. Ah. Like he's so bulky. Is this demon to your liking? Man with all the face and mouths. Alright, if I can use Hecatone Shires to fuse down into Yoshitsune, that'll be that'll be a plus. At any point in time. Okay. Ooh, oh, he's level 66. Come on, I want Giri Makala. He's so good. <coughs> okay. All right, let's see what I can fuse in Loop Garo. Souffle de Claire. Oh my God, there's just so many good dudes. Nihil Claw. Oh my God, is... Could Loop Garo just be better than Yoshitsune? Maybe, maybe. Like. Oh, wait, what? He has, like, no magic attack. He has, like, no magic stat. Why the fuck would they give him this attack? It wouldn't do anything. I'm not really going to farm magic essences for any of this. No, 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 no. I'll, I'll worry about that later. I got one thing in mind right now. Okay, Yoshitsune can be fused from, like, Satanta and Nagaraja, Narcissus. Uh... 
Okay, so let's see if I can put him into Satanta. Or Nagaraja. One of the two. Uh... Okay. Now it wants me to go where? Like, I don't know. Do I want to? Because Alice has 20 more magic than Loki does. I guess I guess I can have Loki in the back. I just bring him in when I need a specific element. Where does it want me to go? I don't know. So let's go out here then. Exclamation points. Like, where does it want me to go? Oh, meet, it said meet him in somewhere. I think. Man, I cannot remember. Ah, no, talk to him here. Okay. Now then, I will go over our plans once more. As I stated earlier, the Japanese branch will become its own entity, separate from Bethel. And in order to save Tokyo, we are going to take God's throne. If there's anything you aren't clear on, now would be the time to ask. Regarding the war of the gods, the Imperium, the throne, or perhaps creation itself, I will explain in full detail. What is the world Ever since time out of mind, the gods would do battle for the right to rule the world. Mm -hmm. Before the creator reigned supreme, the throne belonged to Baal, god of the harvest. And even before that, it was held by Ra, the sun god. Every god who assumes the throne obtains its vast power, enough to reshape the world however they see fit. As such, many a god has fallen in pursuit of that power. The Bower. Regarding the war of the gods, the Empyrean, the throne, or perhaps creation itself, I will explain in f What is the Empyrean? The throne of creation lies at the pinnacle of Empyrean heaven, or simply the Empyrean, as it has become known. That is where the creator would be now were he not ousted by Lucifer, as was claimed. Considering our fusion into a Nahobino, the claim is likely valid. Only Nahobino are allowed in the Empyrean's sacred space. As such, none have entered thus far. Mm. But you, however, can. Do not fear. I won't let you go it alone. I intend to become a Nahobino as well. Who are you fusing with, Koshimizu? Regarding the war of the gods, the Empyrean, the throne, or perhaps creation itself... <clears throat> the throne of creation exists to prove one's dominion over the Earth. Whoever assumes the throne <clears throat> may determine the world's laws and inner workings, much like how the Creator established his own order. Before the Creator, many other gods fought viciously over the throne, and hence the right to rule the world. And in order to save Tokyo, 
we must do the same. Regarding the war of the gods, the Imperium, the throne, but now we know is a god in the fullest or truest sense, our original form, if you will. In ancient times, we were all Nahobino, but when the Creator took the throne, he demanded there be no other gods before him, and diabolized us all. He accomplished this by spiriting our knowledge away. Without the knowledge needed to shape a functioning world, we ceased to be divine, and were left to contend with our fallen nature. Our knowledge was sealed within the Garden of Eden. Mortals soon ate of its fruit, binding all knowledge to their souls and all who came after. Okay. Ever since the fall of man, demons have vied to steal the souls of humankind and restore their former selves. But they were doomed to fail. No, I do not think that of DC Douglas. Also, hop into Discord when you can. Long, it was futile to seek out our knowledge and reclaim our former glory. But with Armageddon fulfilled, the rules have yet again changed. Aogami's true name is Susanoo. As proto-fiend, he was created to inherit the Amatsukami's full power. I myself provided the template. And as I've said before, I am Sukoyomi of the Amatsukami. <clears throat> It is my personal mission to become a Nahobino and rescue Tokyo from the mouth of danger. But to do that, I require your aid. Understood. So will he be the one to create the world, being that only the Nahobino can do it? No, I will. It could very well end up being him. But what if I were to say that you, Yuzuru Atsuta, also have that potential? I do. Oh! So now it starts where we're all going to be pitted against each other with different ideals. After my time spent observing you, I am all but certain you are the one holding my knowledge. What? Yes. If you so choose, you too can harness the power of a Nahobino and recreate the world. Will you not do so in service of your home? The Great Nahobino Wars! But that would mean I'm the same as him? If I really do have that power, enough to save Tokyo, I'll do it. I'll become a Nahobino. Man, we're, I, I forgot, in the S&T game, like in the mainline S&T games, you're just not allowed to have friends. Hmm. Your resolve is admirable. Persona, all about making friends. S&T, all about killing your friends. Excellent. We now have two Nahobino on our side, Atsuta and you. From here, we strike at Bethel headquarters, then make our way to the Empyrean post-haste. Hey, uh, guys? You think I could be a Nahubino too? No, Ichiro, you're bitch made. Not My God. condolences, Dazai. But you do not appear to bear the knowledge of an Amatsukami. Oh. Don't be disheartened. I sense yet another's knowledge resting within you. No way. However, only its owner can identify it. So I suggest you stay on guard. A demon may be lying in wait for you. With that said, I must begin investigating a way to reach the Imperium. I'm fairly certain the secret lies in Ueno, given the density of Bethel mm. security there. So I will concentrate our branch's efforts on that. Sound good. I will contact you the moment I turn up a solid answer. Until then, Please, bear with me. Alright, do I gotta talk to these scrubs? <sighs> Wonder whose knowledge I've got inside me. Does that mean I can be a Nahobino too? I don't know if I'll ever be a Nahobino, but I still want to protect everyone. So I'll fight with what I've got. <sighs> I'd never be able to do it myself, but Master Abdiel might be able to. So, I do know a little bit of spoilery stuff, not like actual story spoilers, but I do think that 
he has Abdiel's knowledge inside of him. <sighs> or something like that. So I'm director Koshimizu's. Somehow I still can't yeah. believe it. But if it's really true, then I won't hesitate. Tokyo is my home, and I'll do everything I can to protect it. Listen. Since you form an Ahobino with Aogami, that is, my brother, Suzano O, you two are likely like family to me. To our mutual success, then. Hmm? I'm just mad that Cleopatra's hey, like level 64. What do you think I should do now? I have, I cannot beat her at my current level. Ten levels is too much. I can't decide anything on my own. Ah, you're bitch made, Daza. I guess I, I really do need Master Abdiel. Uh, say, uh, do you know where she is? Probably show the summit where oh, I beat her ass. All right, let's go see. I don't want to go see. She laid me out. She dumped me into the dirt. Man, I don't want to go see that bitch. Master Abdiel, are you all right? Yeah, she tried to kill us. So let's go back there and be friends. Like what? Dazai, this is why. Like, this I is lost why. I hate. To the Japanese branch, it no longer matters what happens to me. That's not true. You're not done yet, Master Abdiel. I have the knowledge. You saw what happened. Even an archangel is no match for a Nahobino. I still think the name Nahobino is so stupid. Then maybe you just have to become a Nahobino too. Do not give her more power to kill me. Dazai, you saw what happened. I'll find the human who has your knowledge. And I'll bring them to you. That won't be necessary. Uh, but I... They're already here. Huh? It is you, Ichiro Dazai. You are my knowledge. Me? I'm your knowledge? God, I hate him so much. Wait, that means you can use me to become a Nahobino. The power of the Nahobino is forbidden. As the Archangel, I must not defy the condemnation. But if you became a Nahobino, then you could... So, I'm not, <clears throat> like, I, I don't hate him because he's just dick riding Abdiel so hard. I just hate him because he's a little bitch. Like, I hate him because he has, like, I don't know. <laughs> he's just a little bitch. <laughs> That's really all I got. I don't think God would have, like, mucus in his throat. That is not God. <laughs> Alright, so we're about to see everybody do the goddamn fusion dance and shit. No, I did not. <laughs> Was too busy talking smack and being mad at Dazai for being a little bitch. All right, now where do I go? Speaking of which, sounds like that Yakubu broke in again. The log suggests he definitely found out Bethel's joint summit, but I take it he didn't show up there himself. Glad to hear he didn't cause any trouble, but don't relax yet. He's definitely watching for our next move. 
Though after watching that fiasco, he might just be gloating. Seeing Bethel so divided is probably exactly what he wants. It's kind of what I want, too. A moment, please. I always thought there was something about Prime Minister Koshimizu, but I never expected he'd actually be a god. A real god, right out of our myths. That's pretty impressive, right? We're colleagues with a god. Ah, uh, what a shame. I'd love to brag about it, but there's nobody else I could tell. I mean, you could have sex with me. I'm a god. You could be sm you could be yes. smashing a god. After Armageddon forced the myriad gods of Japan to expend their powers and go into hiding, the Japanese branch's strength was depleted and therefore in danger of being absorbed. That's why we used the protofeam technology and mass-produced the Algami model to prove that we could still fight. Because in Japan, protofeams have been created and deployed as heroes time and time again for as long as anyone can remember. Okay. Yes? Hmm? Oh, you're curious about why it's called Bethel? Let's see, if I remember right, it's the name of a location mentioned in the Old Testament of the Bible. Apparently, it means House of God. Yeah, Bethlehem. And it turns out the House of God is full of angels. Big surprise, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, where now? Where to... Hey, can you hear me? I can. Oh, thank goodness. Listen, we need to talk. It's serious. Yes, but how did you come back but from the dead? I can't really tell you here. Would you mind meeting me on the roof? I'll go on ahead. Like, they better explain how she comes back from the dead. So I assume the roof would mean our dormitory again. Yes, there it is. She's back. But how? I saw her die. Look, it's every SMT girl ever. Sorry, I just showed up out of nowhere. I thought you were dead. Yeah, you're not wrong there. The Tao Isonokami you knew did die. But her soul was reborn by a power beyond description, forming who I am now. As the goddess of creation, my new purpose is to guide the Nahobino to his throne. Oh, hell yeah. Can I fuse her? Give me that good shit. Take a good look. Tokyo is fading like the setting sun. Its time is almost up. Before it's too late, I want you to reach the Empyrean and recreate the world. Can do. You risked your life for me and Sahori without even a moment's hesitation. To us, you're a true savior. And in every sense of the word. What power I have shall be yours. And yes. together, we can forge a new future. Until then, will you let me fight at your side? Absolutely. That's all I ask of you. And let us go forward together. We both know God's miracle is dissipating. Tokyo and everyone in it will vanish without a trace. If this stirs your heart even a little, make for the throne and create a new world, one according to your vision. And to foster that, I'll escort you to Dot, where the path to the Empyrean lies. How close am I to the end of the game?
I thought I was only about 60% of the way through, but that makes it sound like it's like 80%. A new realm of Dot lies before us, one that leads to the Empyrean. The path to the Empyrean. It has also been called the Temple of Eternity. Long before the first human being, the entity who oversaw this world created a bridge to the throne. However, Bethel Headquarters has hidden the keys to access it, and so the path remains closed. There are three keys in total. It used to be that Bethel guarded them for safekeeping, but now, the branches that possess them think only of their own gain. So the first thing we need to do is get those keys ourselves. Perhaps a protofiend could detect the energy of divine instruments such as these. I am indeed picking up sources of incredible power. Three in total. Not to mention hordes of demons around them. I say we'd better hurry up and find them. I'm sure you can guess how many Nahobino aspirants are after the keys themselves, so keep an eye out. Can do. Accept the quest, the three keys. Panagia Tau joined your party. Hmm. Let's be off then. Oh, that demon. Seriously. Yeah, that's a pretty good considering you've been following Thanks me. Thanks for helping me out back then. Gosh, I don't know what I'd do without you. But whatever. I see you've got a different girl with you this time. What's up with that? I just got that riz, man. Look at my hair. I'm like Robo As if a goddess like her could ever replace me. <laughs> Come on, you know I'm all you really need. Seriously. Because you and I, we're... Ugh, never mind. Forget this. Wait a moment. Our... So I know we fused with the Proto-Fiend to become like a Proto-Nahobino. But... Are we the ones who are actually holding on to Amanazako's knowledge? <sighs> Anyways, count me in. Someone's gotta keep you out of trouble, right? <laughs> totally. Alright. Oh, no, 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 no. Party. Light of Order. Hmm. Moderate through current role events. Cancel debuffs and... Alright. Tao versus Eden. Because Light of Order is basically Golden Apple. So, is she just a good replacement? Uh, but on the off hand, on the other hand, Eden is just so cute. She's little red riding awesome, but yeah. <sighs> uh, let's see. <laughs> 
I mean, she's level 60 to Eden's 55 at the moment. How much how much MP does my Edun have? 296 to 355. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm not sure. Like they both fulfill roughly the same role. But yeah, I'll I'll bring her along. Ooh, new stuff in Cadaver's Hollow. Sweet. Welcome. Ambrosia. That's not bad. New essences. Hmm. Need any? Oh, need anything else always a oh. all right all right get some recovery going so i need to put spirit drain on her just just so she can do what needs to 